Sad. You have a little baby that can destroy empires in a single city. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see what we got today. This looks boring. This looks boring. And this looks boring. You know. Listen, it can be boring, but at the same yeah. time, we have to go with This is pony sport. It's never boring. This is true. Oh, you know, I feel like there's a certain void in my life, a certain nagging purple horse-shaped hole in my heart. Well, then this I feel a bit of ennui. Well, um, I think I know where that void is coming from. If you look to You're right! Heart. We need a villain! <laughs> <laughs> Court judge certificate issued to Princess Twilight Sparkle. You are not a changeling. Yeah. Get out of my chair! <laughs> 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 it's gonna be one of those ones, kids. <laughs> and where's my cap? I ate it. <laughs> <laughs> That's a banana. <laughs> that's a banana. <laughs> I can't use this is a gavel. That's a that's a ladle. That's a ladle. <laughs> I mean, we still whack the table with it. Right? They can whack the table with that. Oh, right. everything works out. Woo. We're just a big happy family. Okay, who's who's my first uh, client? Oh no! <laughs> I am not going to be judge. I'm certainly going to be an attorney, right? Uh, Really? Hold on, Meanie. Meanie. Oh, dear. Discord. Yeah. You're fired! Sit down! Now! <laughs> you know this is coming. How many bananas did she bring? <laughs> welcome to the real, welcome to the real ponies court. Hooray! down to business. Now for those who have never been here before, in order to need a refresher how this works, here's a quick summary. We'll be having a series of 15 minute trials in which one pony, the plaintiff, I guess will be over here, and will make their case against another pony, the defendant, I guess will be over here, not eating my cheesecake or they die, and they will be sworn in that you, the jury, must solve the case by asking questions which will help us decide who is right and who is not. I, the court marshal, shining armor, that is still somehow stained from last night. Uh, we'll come up to certain points to you with the mic for questions. Please keep all dialogue PG rated. I'm going to dumb that down to G rated because this is a family friendly con. Yes. Oh no, don't laugh at that. <laughs> this is a family event and relevant to our cases. When the clock timer runs out and the buzzer sounds, uh, we must stop and decide by vote if the defendant is innocent or guilty. You will also decide on a punishment for the accused before we move on to the next trial. Now, before we begin, are there any questions? Nope. I'm always 
on a diet, right? <laughs> I definitely don't eat donuts anymore. Really? Is that yeah. true, Donut Joe? How many, how many baked goods have you lost during this incident? <laughs> he ate my entire store's worth of donuts. He ate my cakes, he ate my pies, he even out ate Pinkie Pie with cupcakes. <gasps> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> That's delicious. <laughs> Is this true, Spike? I don't have any memory of it. It couldn't have been me. What could have gotten to the special really? donuts? <laughs> special donuts. Do you mean jelly donuts? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, change in jelly. Well, I guess we will let you, the jury, to decide. So, my first question would be for you, Spike. So, Spike, when was the last time you visited Donut Joe's shop? I don't know. I haven't had much time to go to Canto out lately. They've been doing a bunch of quests. Well, you've been doing a lot of quests lately with all your pony friends, the main six and whatnot. Hmm, that is true. I suppose that's a reasonable alibi, but there have been many times that you have been with us, so what have you been doing in the time that I've been gone? Sitting in the castle. Why would I go anywhere else? Everybody's gone. I can be by myself for a minute and eat donuts from, uh, from Pinkie Pie Shop. <laughs> <laughs> she has her own personal stash. It's great. So approximately when was the last time you had your last donut? <laughs> I mean, you know, um, minus now. Minus now. Let's, let's you know, like Spike, I know it's supposed to be partial to these things, but you're not helping your case. <laughs> this came from Starbucks. It's right over there. I got it from <laughs> <laughs> That's uh, good. Let's go to Donut Show now. Good answer. Donut Show. How long have you been in business? Longer than you've been alive, Twilight. I fed Granny Smith when she was a young lady, okay? So it's like 50 nuts. A hundred years in business so far. Wow, that's quite an impressive business. I did not know that it was a family establishment. It was. My grandfather established it. And when was the last time Spike went to eat at your establishment? Oh, last night. <laughs> But how are you so sure of this? Because I see old dragon claw prints in my donuts that he left uneaten. That is absurd. I would not leave donuts uneaten. <laughs> Single cell. There's no. Wait, 
What? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, maybe I've never this been one and your friends will turn into stone. You don't have to worry. Is that what happens to all your Oh, no. where's my gavel? <laughs> no, where's your banana? Then, uh, uh, all right, that's, that's enough. I will not have my court turn into another circus after like three times. Twilight. Oh. Every Twilight. year. Four. Let, let, let's be real here. We are a circus. <laughs> <laughs> from the audience. So using the evidence provided here for you, you may ask either Spike or Donut Joe questions pertaining to this strange oh, donut hungry trial. I'm hungry for donuts. Right, donut first, Joe, first question. <coughs> donut Joe. Yes. You claim that Spike went all the way from Ponyville to Canterlot in one night. Now I do realize that he has a princess as a friend that he could ride on the back of, but how do you <laughs> proclaim that he went to Canterlot in such a short time? During the night, no less. Who said he went to Canterlot? I have a shop in Ponyville, and he was at home alone last night without Twilight. How do you know this? I have my ways. <laughs> <laughs>
Who is Daisy? Daisy? Daisy. Daisy. Oh, that was that girl in the movie. And she's against oh, an ficus. angry ficus. <laughs> Gloria to Daisy. Let's see if I can just try Gloria to Daisy. It sounds like something I made up in fan fiction, but I would love to hear about that. That's what I was a camp counselor. 
before I was overthrown by that man right there. First off, when did you get a TV show? And second, um, I would know. I just lost my train of thought. Sorry. <laughs> uh, final photo. Um, what is that? What? Very fizzy, folks. It's gone fizzy. Very fizzy. Electric. Electric's in there. No, seriously. I have no idea who that lady is. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. Well, um, this has been interesting. Um, Miss Daisy Gloriosa, let, why don't we ask you? I'm not done talking. <laughs> <laughs> we got 15 minutes and you already used up probably like seven of it, so. <laughs> I used up no more than five. There's no way I used up more than five. I, you're a plant. You can't tell time sometimes. You only tell, hi, that's a sun, or hi, that's, that's not a sun. <laughs> 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 and I don't believe you. What did you say? That's racist. That's, that's racist. racist. <laughs> that as a plant, you can't tell. <laughs> 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 Step above mayonnaise, that's really what it is. <laughs> <laughs> I am a step above rock, miss. 
<laughs> oh, okay, so that's how it's done. Gotcha. <laughs> The jury had all of the questions basically for me, so I believe I should win this and I want the game. <clears throat>
things went wrong, and I ended up in another world where there were these these unicorns, and they were they were trapped. They were in a stable. They were locked up. They they were enslaved, and I had to protect them. I had to free them. Aha! So you admit you were trespassing in my homeland, you person with a buddy. I <laughs> Wandered over there? That is still called trespassing immunity! Well, here's. Well, wait a minute. I believe this was submitted by Discord. So here's some evidence. Interdimensional case needs an interdimensional lawyer. Right. So let's take a look at this evidence. So um, I'm assuming that's you, Starlight.
you want to think to sure, do you really? I don't think you want this one as your attorney. I don't think I want this one either. I I objection! Objection! This is kangaroo court. <laughs> I, you, what are kangaroos? Court. I just want I to say, like, given her history of messing up, you should let it go because that's just what Starlight does best. <laughs> Yeah, no, we oh. met that guy. We met that guy that one time, remember? That's oh, yeah. Right. Weren't you at the picnic last year? I totally was. That was fun. Oh, I remember that. Was that. Yeah. On I here. don't know Starlight Order! That okay. was a really fun volleyball game. Twilight. <laughs> Twilight. Oh, there was so much mess. Is it time for me to go into the audience, ask whatever crazy questions that are about to happen right now? Yes, I think let's ask the jury some questions. All right. Are we asking them questions? You! He why do you have a head on top of a body, <laughs> and why is it not floating like my best friend, who is a flying pony head? Starlight River is about a different dimension than on the body head that you know. Alright, we're gonna let that one with the disheveled shirt ask questions now. Hi, I'm disheveled, apparently. And this is your first question. Let's go. Okay, first off, for all of you, what? <laughs> and second off, Starlight, how did you even know about the mirror? Like you always do, Sar. Objection! Are those nachos still at home and can we get them when we're done? Objection! I'm not on trial here! Oh my here. gosh. <laughs> Stuff. They're actually in there for your protection. We didn't put the lock on there, they did. 
It's like, they're like, yo, dude, we don't want anyone breaking in and stealing our workout equipment. Yeah, bro, that's a great idea. Let's put a lock on this. So they put themselves in there, friend. Why would they do that? I don't know. I don't understand more than corn culture. So you're saying that horses in other dimensions, they don't act the same way that they do in Equestria? That is correct. My best friend stole a pair of scissors with her flying pony head. And then she jumped to different dimensions and we went clubbing. It was awesome. And then abandoned me in one. Yeah, that wasn't. That you was abandoned your old friend? Oh, no, 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 no. No, no, my, my other best friend, who is now also his best friend, because we're all best friends, she abandoned him. <laughs> oh. oh. But we went back and got him one This isn't pertinent to the case. My class yes. refused to so continue speaking. Yes. All right, all right. You. <laughs> Okay. Oh, he's bringing cheese. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's go get yes. nachos. Yeah. Nachos are 